right here guys I'm uh, down here in the streets of Providence it's about I don't know 4 30 maybe 5 o'clock on Monday morning here and uh, we're gonna take a walk down here today and see if we can find somebody who needs prayer and of course that would be anybody who Jesus died for and like I always say if you can find somebody who we didn't die for well don't pray for that person otherwise we're gonna have to pray so we're hoping to see somebody here this morning. Uh, I'm not sure how much how much time I have on this video, but uh, let's just pray. Father, I just pray right now, Jesus, Jesus, Father in heaven, I pray, God, that you would put somebody, Lord Jesus, in my path. Somebody, Father, that needs your love, that needs your prayer. A heart that is broken, that needs to be healed somebody struggling with addiction Jesus maybe somebody that has a physical ailment that has lost their job Lord God I just want to pray father that right now father bring them to me Lord and use me daddy use me to touch them use me to pray for them Jesus see anybody there just hoping to find somebody here this morning Kind of, kind of empty around here this morning, but I'm just praying, man. I'm just praying, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I love you, Lord. Thank you for using me. Thank you for blessing me with the Holy Spirit who dwells in me, Father. There's somebody there, but it looks like a woman. I don't want to scare her. You got to kind of be cool with who you come up on here. You know, it's early in the morning. It's dark and. You know, you just got to wait and move as the Spirit moves you, you know. Um, it's not just about jumping on people and praying for them because then it becomes about you. It's about how the Spirit moves you. You know, it's not about praying for people, expecting them to see a healing. I mean, certainly we pray with expectation, but it's if we make it about having to see them be healed, then it's about us again, you see. Why do we pray for people? Well, we pray for people because that's what God tells us to do, you know? He tells us to pray, so that's what we do. We pray, and we leave it in God's hands. That's our only job, okay? So don't get all hung up on, well, this one didn't get healed, or that one didn't get healed, or this one wouldn't let me pray for him, which, by the way, has never happened to me, but everybody needs prayer what you're going to see every time is you're going to see when you pray for people you're going to see tears man because people need to be loved because people are broken and they're hurting in this lost and dying world man it's like a ghost down here this morning well we'll just keep on praying man keep praying keep walking keep checking it out before you know it you never know what the good lord's going to bring you but you know what the good thing is? When you pray and you walk in the Spirit, it doesn't matter who comes along. I'm just out here, man. I'm just out here walking for Jesus. I'm just out here reflecting the love and the light of Jesus Christ. That's all I do, you know? And as the Lord moves me, I go, you know? And it doesn't matter. It's, it's, it's awesome. When you walk with God, man, you just, it's always cool. It's always awesome. Boy, it stinks down here, man. It smells like, uh, I don't know, like pollution or something. But anyway, uh, I'm probably going to turn around. Um, you know, man, maybe I'll come back a little bit later. It seems pretty chilly out right now. It's 10 of 6, as you can see up there on that clock. I think, is that a clock up there? I don't know, man. What's that clock at? Oh, that is a clock. Yeah, 10 of 6, man. I see, see now there's a dude down there at the alleyway on a bike. He's probably, but well, I don't know, man. See, this is the thing, man. You don't want to be coming up on people, jumping up in their face. And again, the Lord will put them in your path, you see. It's all, it's all about Jesus, man. You, you know, you, you got to take yourself out of the equation when it comes to walking and working for the Lord. And that's what's so cool, you know. It's so cool because he's in control. You just put yourself out there and you watch how Jesus works. 
All right, man. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna sign out um, for a few minutes here, and then we'll see what's up. I'll be coming back. I got just this bogus iPhone, so I can't pause and come back. But um, let's see what happens. Now here's a guy right over here, man. I'm feeling this cat right here, man. All right, here we go. I'm feeling this cat. See, now Jesus is drawing me over to this dude, man. See? I can see him right over here, man. See what he's up to. Right over here. This dude. This is pretty cool. All right, man. That's a guy right here. He needs to be loved, man. You don't care about them. Look at this, man. God led me right to a Methodist church. Check it out. God led me right to a Methodist church. Check it out. Ha ha ha. You tell me what's up. Hey, how's it going? Is this church open, brother? Or are you opening it right now? No. Oh, you're just hanging out here? Oh, all right. I just saw you, man. I was just hoping I could come up. Can I, can I say a prayer for you, bro? I don't know. I just, yeah, yeah, I, I need it. I need it. I just felt like God called me over to pray with you this morning, right. man. Uh, Father, I just want to pray. What's your name, brother? Anastasio. What is it again? Anastasio. Anastasio. Father, I just want to pray for Anastasio this morning. God, Jesus, I just pray, God, you would fill him with the Holy Spirit today, Lord. Father, keep him safe. Protect him. Give him what he needs, Jesus. God, I just don't know his... I'm not sure what he's, what's going on in this man's life, but I just felt Jesus call me over here 6 o'clock on Monday morning, man, just to love yeah. this brother. Just to love him, man. Let him know Jesus loves him. And I love him, man. Thank you. Yeah, man. I thank you, God, for putting this man in my path. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. God bless you, brother. God bless you, man.